Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Zach here with Unreal Adventures. Today I'm going to be doing a little pond fishing. If you can't tell already, there's some uh, great weed lines, great vegetation. Uh, I'm going to get the kayak in today. Uh, we're going to see what works. I'm going to maybe try some top water, try some swim baits, but uh, who knows? We'll see what happens. I'm going to try and get on some fatties today. So uh, without any further ado, I'm going to get to fishing. All right, guys, just got out on the water in the old yakadoodle do. I've seen some bass already crushing some top water. I don't know, I haven't thrown anything yet, but if you can't tell already, they're just popping all over out here. Man, just right in front of me, this is crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Oh, just had one try and nab me right there. This is awesome. This is gonna be a good day, I can tell already, guys. Now generally, in a place like this, you'd wanna fish these weed lines, especially early in the morning, but it's right in the middle of the day. It's kinda of hot out. I'm uh, seeing them pop, you know, just I'm maybe 25 foot off the weed line here, and I see them kinda of popping out here so we're gonna give this a shot now I don't really know how deep it is I've only fished this pond once actually uh, my last video a couple videos ago I was out here with my wife and uh, I mean as you can tell there's just not any real good bank access I mean there's all kinds of weeds and vegetation all over we did find a pond on the other side of this one that's like, kind of like an overflow pond we managed to catch a few small largemouth for you guys but uh we didn't get into anything that great well i was smart enough to bring the kayak today my wife's uh at school right now so she's not able to make it out here so i brought the kayak and I'm gonna see if I can catch some toads. Really gotta do something about the squeak in this reel. It's a little bit insane. Couple things I wanna try today. First of which obviously is gonna be a top water. Seems like they're really just hitting on top water right now. A little surprising being the time of day, you know, right in the noonday sun, but that's okay. I'll take them where I can get them. Here we go guys. We got some nice submerged structure here A little bit of wood. Oh, oh, is he gonna come for it? Yep, there he was Feels like a pretty nice one guys. Oh He threw it well We know they're in here. I don't think it was too big. I'm gonna guess three pounds I didn't get a real good look at it, but it felt pretty uh, hefty, hefty, hefty. That's rather uh, annoying that I just lost that, but you know, you can't always, can't win them all, right? Did you guys see that? That's a freaking toad. Oh my goodness. Oh, he missed it. That was a five pounder at least, guys. That was insane. I thought he was on there. Ended up just being a bunch of freaking moss. Just a wee bit ticked off that I missed that guy. He was for sure a hog. Every bit of five pounds. I don't know if you guys could see him on there uh, on the camera, but man, when he came up out of the water, Man, I'm still, not only does my butt hurt from the kayak, but my butt is still hurt from losing that super nice freaking bass. That's all right. Oh, nope. God dang it. That was another nice one, guys. He just came up and just flat slaughtered it. Why can I not get these hook sets? 
This area right here should be a gold mine. Yep. Nothing great. He popped it. I wish the other ones would have <laughs> got it. But uh, little guy, little guy takes the cake on this one. I was hoping he would be wee. Ow, you son of a buck. I was hoping he would have been a little bit bigger, a little tiny guy. Let's get him back in the water. Dang it. Now bring out your big brother and your big sister and your mom. And your dad. And your sister, the hot one. Not the hot one. Bring out your sister, the fat one. Leave the hot skinny one at home. I like him thick. Oh my gosh, that was another freaking hog. Did you see the head on that guy? All right. No worries. Let's bring him back through there. He's coming up for round two. That was another fat one. I don't know if you guys can see the head. The distortion on the GoPro is a little, a little bad sometimes, but that guy, he was every bit of four pounds. I mean, his head was massive. Just another wee little guy, man. I keep landing the small ones and the big ones I keep missing out on, man. That's so sad. Check it out, guys. Little guy, maybe like a quarter pound. Quarter pound of where's your cheese, dog? Looks like we got into another area, guys, that's not gonna be the best for top water. I mean, I'm. Wow, there's two or three of them there, the whole school of them. That's a nice bass. Let's see if I can get it up here before I lose it. Not a bad bass by any means, guys. There's another one up here. I saw him, he had a friend with him. get you a look at him he's a he's pretty toady guys he's probably every bit of two and a half pounds he's probably bordering three i would say great giggly miggly gorgeous he popped that as soon as it hit the water essentially hey thanks for sticking around had a great time out on the kayak lost some really really good bass oh it just ooh, it hurts my heart but I think guys, I was just uh, setting the hook a little too fast. I went back and reviewed some of the videos and uh, yeah, I was just not letting them take it. You know, sometimes when you just see that giant splash, you just get a little bit anxious and you get in a hurry. You know, I thought I was taking enough time after watching myself, you know, I'm gonna correct that mistake next time. I'm definitely gonna go back out to that pond because it was just amazing. There was some giant bass in there. So I'm gonna make sure I hook up on some of those for you guys. Uh, I appreciate you sticking around. Uh, if you like the video, go ahead and subscribe. You can follow along on Instagram at un underscore real, R-E-E-L underscore adventures. And like always, guys, it's a good day to fish. <laughs>